All right, this video is about cloning the hard drive in your laptop. And it's a very simple and quick procedure. This is a cable that's sold by Crucial. Uh, you can also get it at Amazon.com. It's a, a data cable and it's a, a SATA uh, connection to a SATA drive. And you just plug in your USB into your laptop. You put your software in and you follow the instructions on the screen and it's called cloning and it'll be identical to what you have in your, in your laptop and that way there it's all backed up so if you ever have a crash or your hard drive quits on you you have a backup um, this is very easy to do I'll put some information in, uh, in the um, description underneath this video so you can uh, follow some links to get the cable and to get um, an adapter if you need an adapter to switch it over to a, an IDE style connection which is a bunch of pins I think there's like 44 pins in that um, you can do either hard drive doesn't matter which one um, this is this a little item is only like seven dollars the cable is about nineteen dollars to twenty seven dollars depending upon where you buy that all right this hard drive has already been cloned but I'm just gonna go through these screens to show you what you're gonna see after you install the software all right over here it says let's get started and you want to just click on that now it's gonna look for your hard drive it's searching for it right now. It might take a second to do that. Okay, now it's going to ask you the source drive, which is usually number one at the top. And all you got to do is see that it has Windows operating system in it. So does in the other one too, but if it's a blank hard drive, you, you won't see that. It'll be just blank. So you say number one, you just click on that, and then you go to next. And it's going to ask you for the destination. You click on that. And you go next. And then it's going to look at it. And it's going to say you are almost ready to clone. All you got to do is say next. And then right down at the bottom it says start clone. Okay, I'm not going to do it because I already did this hard drive. But that's all the screens you got. And then you just wait for this to finish and you're done and you got a second hard drive all loaded in with everything that's on the hard drive that's in your computer already it's as simple as that all right hope this helps you guys later